right, coming up next, it's a UFC middleweight division fight. All right, so as this young fighter makes the walk here tonight, you know his inner monologue is, how do I get this opponent down? Because once I get him to the mat, I know I can keep him there. Joe, this guy has a top game as scary as anybody in the game. And when you can control a fighter like that in a fight, it's a great source of confidence. He'll use the body weight to keep you down and prevent any sort of hip escapes because his hips are so strong. Physical freak who will sap your willpower and your gas tank with the best of them. This guy has ridiculous hand speed. His opponent is gonna need to keep his chin tucked and his hands up high. Well, if you choose to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and stand and trade with this young man, you're playing with fire. Frightening knockout power. Go look at the highlight reel. As good a reel as anybody in the sport, you can be sure he'll be looking to find a home for those heavy hands early and often. You do not want to get in a slugfest with this young contender. I can assure you of that. This guy has ridiculous hand speed. If this fight comes to a striking exchange, he will have a distinct advantage. Our tale of the day for this much anticipated middleweight encounter. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age and they both possess a similar height and reach. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, Golden. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 17 wins, 5 losses. He stands 6 feet 1 inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Brad Tavares. And the action begins on referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean, Dean our referee for this one. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, we're underway here at the famed Madison Square Garden right in New York City. Trademark inside leg kick there by the Hawaiian Brad Tavares. Another shot lands upstairs. He's timing that jab brilliantly. Tavares gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Oh, big shot. Watch the shot here, Joe. Tavares gets absolutely punished by that hit. Clean punch. Oh, effective use of the jab here, Joe. And he connects there. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Tavares. Landed that one. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Wow! He's got him here. Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? And now starting to snap off that jab. Oh, man, is that a hard inside leg kick. Looking to avoid that left hand. That was a big left hand. Maybe he threw that with every ounce of his being. Hard straight punch. Vicious combination. Lands a kick, Joe. Oh, big shot. Oh! oh. He's hurt oh, here. Oh, he might be out. Oh! Body kick, look at that. Doing an excellent job blocking. Splits the guard, connects with the punch there, Joe. Good combinations. 
All right, so there's a swing and a miss from him, and sometimes when you miss, it can tax your gas tank even more than when you land a strike. So clearly, it is energy preservation time at this point of the fight. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. And both guys really throwing with authority. Big body kick. The left hook hits home. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Oh, another crisp jab lands flush. Nice way to keep the opponent at distance there. Switching stances here. Nice leg kick. Oh! Nice left to the body. It appears a cut has opened up on his cheek. He blocks the punch. Well, you gotta like the way he has started this fight tonight. He is cold. Oh! That one hurt him badly. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. an incredibly large volume of strikes, but this last one was the big one that landed for the knockout. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. And let's see that again. Bam! Nighty night. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 40 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by... Oh, oh. Golden! So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night, I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches, and his friends after this monumental victory here under the bright lights tonight.